I think so. Okay. Hey friends, how's it going? My name is Jeremy and this is La Comida Jeremy. If you're new here, you may not know that in 2021, I will be a full-time artist, creator, small business owner, entrepreneur, freelancer, whatever you want to call it. Basically, I need to reorganize and structure my life this last week of December so that I can start the new year with a bang. Also, can I just mention that we are in the last week of December that is freaking insane, which is exactly why I wanted to vlog and record and just film this final week of this year, because honestly this year has been the craziest time in a lot of our lives, including mine. It also has been a very exciting time, and it granted me the opportunity to go full-time as a creator, which I'm so thankful for. What I'm gonna be doing in this studio vlog is filming the process of reorganizing my studio space. It's actually already organized for the most part. I cleaned it the other day. I have everything that I need, but I need to restock on some shipping items, some stuff to make more products. I'm also going to be finishing this gallery wall, which I said I was going to finish so long ago and I never did. When I wake up in the morning, I need to be inspired right away because if not, what I do is just lounge around and do nothing, which is not a good thing because I literally just got the last paycheck for my full-time job last Friday. So it's time to get my shit together basically. Sunday and the sun is currently setting so I'm not going to do too much more today but I am about to decorate this gallery wall and film it for TikTok so let's get to it. <laughs> to this one. I do love this little corner. I think I want to grow it downwards versus upwards and then maybe onto this wall. I just have like inspiration from other artists. These are also like some of my favorite artists so I'm really excited to have their pieces in my um, studio so that way when I need inspiration. <laughs> in order. Yes, I want to get the vegetable my fun. So my fun, okay. Anything else? Yes, and the uh, the maple bean curd. Uh, can I have your name, please? Jeremy. Jeremy, uh, give uh, 15 minutes. Okay, perfect. Thank you. Okay, thanks. Um, bye bye. so freaking heavy hey guys so i may have just made a new print so i've been doing a challenge of drawing or recreating in my style 10 to 12 famous pieces frida kahlo um there's just one from ponce puerto rico they're just like some pieces that i asked my followers for and so like a lot of them involve humans which i'm not the greatest at drawing people just drawing people has never been my specialty but also what i wanted to do with drawing people was really create a style for myself when drawing humans but now i'm at the point where i'm kind of done drawing people and i'm really bored of it so i decided to draw an animal tonight yeah i'm very happy with how it came out i'm very into just like messy lines not really coloring in between the lines really happy with how this came out so i'm planning to turn this into a print I was like, you say it after I poked it with the scissors. Careful with those scissors. <laughs> it's for your channel. A garlic peeler. Honestly, I don't know what the fuck I sent you at this point. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so I'm gonna get this done. Um, 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 I'm gonna
so cute! Oh, it's so cute! <laughs> it's funny because I, I got this drawing too. <laughs> Like turmeric, garlic. You can literally get like cinnamon sticks and like. I saw them. it on your store yesterday. I was like, I've always wanted one of those. <laughs> so yeah, so one, you're welcome. So one of them is that. Happy Monday. So I have been coasting through today. I don't know what is wrong with me. I just don't have motivation to do anything. But I did go to my mailbox. I sent my bank letters. Basically, when you open up a business bank account, you have to sign a bunch of paperwork and send things like proof and that kind of stuff. I finally mailed that. I already got my debit card. I deposited my first um, check. And so now I'm just waiting for everything to clear so that I can start using it. Running a business is not easy whatsoever. I will definitely say that. Also, like starting one takes a lot of freaking work. So I can't can't wait for all of this to be settled and like done with so I can move on with my life. Anyways, as you guys saw, I got some happy mail and I'm so obsessed with this freaking gnome that my friend Hazel sent me. I just think it's so cute. I love to have little like trinkets and things around the house. So I've been so obsessed with gnomes for some reason this year. I have this illustration of my boyfriend and I as gnomes. I also made ring holders are gnomes and I'm just... I don't know. I just like gnomes for some reason. So sticking with the Happy Mail theme, I really wanted to show you guys some of the things that I got from my boyfriend for Christmas. Really quickly. Oop, my phone. I got this mug with all the the female villains, the baddies. This is so freaking cute. I'm highly obsessed with it. I also have a pin that we got when we went to Disney World last December. So this matches that and I'm very excited about it. Sorry if you don't like to curse, but... Y'all know this is part of my brand. It's so cute though, very me. I am obsessed with these mugs. They're also freaking huge. And I don't really drink coffee that much, but I do drink a lot of chocolate milk. And so, choco mugs. As you guys know, I'm like really obsessed with like Tim Burton, spooky stuff, Halloween is my favorite holiday. And so like, I don't really like my house to look like that that much, but I do like to have little pieces here and there. So if you know the movie Beetlejuice by Tim Burton, basically this was the book that they used to cross over to the other side. It's a book, but also it hides things. But along with my mug collection, I also have a pin collection that I don't know what to do with, but I really want to display it somehow. But he got me these little um, pins that I can add to my collection. I also got two keychains. I collect keychains. I obviously collect things. I didn't know this, but I guess I do. I have these keychains over here that I've started my little collection with. I just like to leave them on here. I don't really put them on my keys because they're too clunky. I like to have them around my office and art space just to give me inspo. So I got some sriracha. And then the last keychain that he got me is this one right here. And the two other things that he got me are these shirts. This is what he said he is of me sick of my shit. It's cute though. I just love graphic tees and so he got me two more to add to my collection. I thought that was really cute and then like I said I just love spooky stuff. So this is Adopt a Familiar. If you don't know what a familiar is, basically watch Sabrina, the Netflix series or any witch show. And a familiar is basically the animal that a lot of these wizards and witches and people have. He also got me some chocolate syrup because as I said, choco milk. Anyways, so I wanted to talk to you guys really quickly about what I've been doing for the past week or so. I've been taking a break from social media so that I can really go all in with La Comida Jeremy, which is also why I'm recording this video. Basically, I signed up for a website called Notions. This is not sponsored whatsoever, but I'm a huge fan of this website. And so what I'm using it as is my La Comida Jeremy HQ, my headquarters. And so in there is like my task, my tasks for like every day, every week, every month, and for the year, my goals that I want to accomplish in the new year. I also have things like ideas for posts, ideas for videos, things that I want to make. Just like I have literally put all of my brain dump in there. Second thing that I've been working on, you may have heard me talk about this on my Instagram stories recently, but basically I wanted to create something where my supporters can financially support me and also receive something back. But currently I've been working on a private membership platform because I really just want to build community. So yeah, I'm still figuring that out, but I literally just started doing that this weekend. So I'm working on that. But right now it is dinner time. Not really, it's like three o'clock, but basically it's, it's time to prep food. So I'm hungry and I really want a cheeseburger. So let's go do that.
so it is currently 11 30 and i have been here finalizing the details for my patron site but also looking up different manufacturers and stuff so what i've done here is try to find like the shirts that have the best quality but also are from recycled material because i'm also trying to be eco-friendly with my products if i'm outsourcing them so i like to kind of get some quotes from different manufacturers well, yeah that's what i'm doing the other thing that i wanted to mention is if you are a small business owner you want to offer products like this i'd like to ask my followers and see if they would be interested in buying something ask some questions for the t-shirts i'm just asking like hey in the future or very near future would you like a t-shirt and if so what size are you and so that helps me when i'm making decisions on ordering products and also in the future when i want to order some other stuff i kind of have an idea in my mind of what my clients customers followers supporters la comida jeremy family they would like to buy from me I've been filming for the past like two or three hours um, a art studio tour it took me so long my studio is not that big it's also in my bedroom so I don't know why it took me so long I think it's gonna come out so good so impeccable I'm so excited but now it's done and I can start the new year with fresh new videos that people have been asking me for so if you're one of those people it's it's coming it's 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 here for you and I'm so excited if you are a creator or you're wanting something in life this is your sign to just go do it I created this space with the little money that I had, little money that I have. Some of this stuff I got for free, some of this stuff I got really cheap at the thrift store, and little by little, it literally took me like a year or something to build this space and make it what I wanted it to be. Do what you gotta do, little by little you'll get there, but I hope that this serves as inspiration for you to go get that thing that you want in life. I wanna say thank you so much because it is because of you guys and the people that have shopped for my store, the people that share my stuff. I am able to do this full time now and I'm so thrilled, so excited. I'm also really nervous because I gotta figure out how to make more money to pay my bills, but I'm here, I'm making it happen and I'm so excited. Yeah, now I'm gonna go make some food because I'm hungry. So let's, let's go do that. friends happy wednesday it is almost the end of the year it's so freaking crazy i'm on my way to the store i'm gonna go to a couple stores to run some errands i want to get some new cleaning supplies and just like a fresh scent for the house i like to bring the new year in like super duper fresh everything sparkling clean i know a lot of people don't like the like new year resolutions and that kind of stuff but i'm a huge fan of them i mean no you don't stick to everything but i think it's always great to reevaluate your life find new things to be passionate about so that's what i'll be doing i'm also going to michael's to get a new sketchbook i want to do a 365 day challenge i'm gonna be drawing every single day next year if you're a patron you'll get to see behind the scenes of this if you're not you'll basically see some of the final products that i make but anyways i'm gonna take you guys along with me so let's go do that we're going to guys this target has a black lives matter slash black history month section so freaking cute <laughs> Just like to note 
that I woke up super early this morning. It is currently 9 30 9 29 your boy is like dressed like I even got pants on I got jeans on but yeah I'm ready to go I don't know where I'm going it's literally raining it's been raining since I showed you guys yesterday so yesterday I cleaned my house as you guys saw I highly recommend starting your new year your new week your new chapter with a clean home a clean slate organize your files as well on your computer on your phone like just organize your whole freaking life for like a weekend and I swear to you you are going to feel so much better now I just feel so wholesome and clean and the air feels fresh my house smells so clean I've been working from home remotely all year and now I'm a full-time freelance creator and so I've been home just like non-stop so what I've been trying to do the past couple months is create a routine where I clean at least something every single day one big room that way I'm, on the weekend I can really just relax did I mention that tonight is New Year's Eve I don't know if I said that I don't know but basically it is New Year's Eve and we're just gonna stay home. Anyways, I'm gonna go edit this video some more and we'll catch up for tonight's festivities. <laughs> <laughs> All over the cabinets. <laughs> <laughs>